Hey guys, it's me Noah here with the CP Gamers, and today I'm going to show you just how I made some very cheap lights out of some holiday lights that I found on Amazon. And I used it in my latest Solus mock, and here is the final results. So as you can see, all I did was string these holiday lights through the big uh, chunk of Lego that I made, and I'll show you how I made that towards the end of the video. But I left a little hole in there, and then I strung it up and weaved it up and around through the inside of the structure. Now like I said, I found these on Amazon. They were only $7.00. And they have a bunch of different functions. Like you can see right here, I have it uh, flickering on and off. And I think that's really cool. I didn't actually use it too much in the mock to have it flicker, but it's really cool. My favorite part about these lights was that they were white lights instead of the yellowish lights that you might think, uh, you know, common cheap lights are. But no, these were white. And as you can see, it has a little box connected to it with a button. And it lets you to change between the flashing speed uh, and the flashing frequency and stuff. So that's how I got all these different effects, and I think it's an awesome thing to do. And if you haven't tried using lighting in your LEGO mocks, you definitely need to try it because it's not that hard, and it creates a much better final product than you might think. So definitely try and do that. Go search up Amazon. I'll try and put the link in the description for the exact lighting box that I used and found there. It was very cheap, like I said, so you need to go and try and find that, and then use it in your mocks, and let me know how it works, guys. So I'm going to show you quickly how I disassembled it, and you can see how I weaved the um, the lighting through the mock, but I'll show you that in a time lapse coming right up, and thank you guys for watching, and I will see you soon with more videos, so stay tuned, hit that like button and the subscribe button, and I appreciate it very much, guys. See you later.